and welcome to the very first video of Equine Photography 101. I thought the most natural way of starting this series was by talking about the different equipment that I use for equine photography. My equestrian photography mainly consists of um, portrait sessions, uh, training sessions and shows, mainly show jumping but also polo and dressage. The camera house that I use is the Nikon V7000 and really it's been with me all the way. It has taught me everything that I know and it has been a great companion along the way. I can't show you the camera now because I'm using it to film. I'm thinking about retiring it and retiring it this year and upgrading to a new camera house sometime this year. So we'll see where that goes. There are mainly two lenses that I use for equine photography and really one of them I use 90% of the time and that is this one. This is my Tamron 70-200mm 2.8. I can't say anything bad about it, it's a great lens and I love the results that I get with it. If you have, if you have the opportunity to get one of these I'm really happy with it. The second lens is one that I mainly use for indoor shooting close um, where there's little space or portraits and it's this. This is my Sigma 35mm um, 1.4 and it's one of the art series lenses and it's a brilliant lens. Really I don't use it enough um, but every time that I do use it I'm reminded how good it is. I'm reminded of how good it is. So yeah this is a brilliant one. The reason why I got a 35mm and not a 50mm is because that on a cropped and cropped camera this is actually the equivalent of 50mm. The next thing that I'm going to show you is one thing that I try not to leave the house without, especially living where I live. And when I do live without it, I regret it so much. And it is this. This is my Kata raincoat for the camera and it's a E702PL. It's a lifesaver, I can't say anything bad about it. It enables me to take photos even in the worst of weather. If you live somewhere where it tends to rain a lot, do consider getting one of these. They are brilliant. This is pretty much the equipment that I use for aquan photography. And um, please, if you have any questions, do leave them below. And I will see you next time. Bye!